What's up? How are you guys this week? Another Monday of me complaining I need a permanent vacation down at Frankie's Free Range Meat. So I'd like to start off, same as last week, reading a couple of very kind reviews uh, from some of my lovely customers. And, you know, I get a lot of reviews every week, but, you know, some of them are very sweet or they highlight some specific stuff that uh, I've been working really hard on lately. So this one's from, I, I won't say the person's name, some people like to remain private, but if you're watching, thank you for supporting me. Hi all, I want to tell you how amazing your packaging abilities are. My shipment of raw meat was sent on February 22nd, but because of various reasons, wasn't delivered until this evening, March 1st. And the meat was still nice and cold, even though the dry ice was long gone. Thank you for being great packers. I was completely expecting rotten food tonight, but not. Wonderful. Uh, so this is something out of our control. You know, UPS will sometimes hold a package over the weekend, and we're not exactly going to spend $300 to ship everything one day air. That's not how a, a meat company operates. But since we use a lot of ice, since we pack everything, there are scenarios where you know spending that extra money paid off. In general, maybe not, but we do have one more happy customer and uh, if not, I just refund the person's money. So more often than not, they end up getting a full refund the second they email me. So this next review is for the best burger blend ground beef, toddler approved. I honestly have a hard time getting my four year old to eat more meat, but after trying some and hearing him say he wants to eat this every day, I couldn't help but leave a review. There's definitely a slight difference in taste compared to the normal 80-20 I buy from Frank. We honestly love this blend and we'll be buying more in the future. Uh, so if you guys are unfamiliar, I started Best Burger Reviews a couple months ago. That <laughs> hasn't exactly been going so well. But we came out with a special burger blend. Uh, there's some chuck in there. I can't remember what else off the top of my head. But, you know, it's a very fresh, 100% grass-fed grind. And that's special stuff that I like to do more and more of once I can get my own meat packing operation. I'm really doing as much as I can now. Uh, but please, guys, if you're trying any of the ground beef blends, the ribeye, whatever it is, let me know how you like it because I put a lot of work and effort into this stuff and I hope you guys do enjoy it. And another person left a review uh, for the Mastic Gum saying that they could actually sleep now and that when they purchased other Mastic Gums on Amazon, those weren't working. So you have to be somewhat careful because they will add filler as Mastic is very expensive. Uh, if you guys didn't watch my video on H. pylori some months back, it's like a stomach bug when people have compromised liver function, candida, uh, the H. pylori overgrows, and the main symptom of that is insomnia. But using mastic gum, taking a teaspoon with your meals, as you guys have seen me doing basically every day of eating, helps you sleep. Uh, so let's jump into what's going on today, because I don't want to stand here and read for five more minutes. I'm actually filming this vlog on my guy's lunch break, which is excellent, so you guys don't have to hear the loud packing tape and the banging and all the background noise, but my guys have been working hard since 7 a.m. We have a lot of the meat orders packed up, and I think this week is officially the busiest week on record where we've had the most orders. The volume has increased substantially, and as always, I wanna thank you guys so much for supporting the business, continuing to support us, we do offer a lot of special products at some of the best prices online. And it's really the culmination of me losing my mind and doing things that no other business does, really having new products every week and um, having excellent, excellent, excellent customer service. So, you know, we have a crazy amount of orders that the guys already did. We have more in the freezer. And I also have like another 50 orders that we got to send out uh, tomorrow. So my guys have been really busy. I know some of you are waiting on orders from Frankie's Free Range Foods. Um, my guys did make the best bars, but they didn't have time to wrap them up. So hopefully we can get all of the foods orders out later this week. And the beef jerky is back in stock. We still don't have pemmican. So yeah, my guys are a little bit behind. We did get the water kefir in. We still do have some of the apple banana macadamia bars left. And I will change the formula on that very soon, but uh, just for a better texture and for ease of making it. So I'll give you guys that update when I do it. But first, let's venture into the depths of the freezer because we do have a few very cool products to look at today. Some of them new, some of them not. So these look like regular Wagyu steaks and they technically are, but they're the steak ends. So these are incredibly, incredibly cheap and affordable. 
uh, compared to the regular Wagyu steaks we're offering. I forgot what I listed these on the website for. I think it's between 15 and $20 for basically a one pound Wagyu steak, which is a guy, that's completely unheard of. Uh, the catch is they're mixed. So like you might get a strip steak, you might get a Wagyu steak, but this is by far 100% the cheapest price a Wagyu steak has ever been sold for online, 100%. Contrasting that, however, we have, uh, I guess, more legitimate Wagyu steak. So this is Wagyu Tomahawk. These are very big, guys. And we have a few different sizes. Uh, some of them are around $100, the smaller size. And the larger ones are around $150. But these are still by far the cheapest online. Guys, this is like a you know three to four pound steak. This will feed your whole family. It's special, it's a centerpiece. You put a lot of salt and pepper on it, throw it on the grill. That's what it's really, really for. Um, I figured we would try it, see if you guys liked it. But to me, you know, Frankie's Screenage Meat is more about providing very high quality meat affordably. And although this is affordable as it's the lowest price Wagyu online, I don't think Wagyu for most people is affordable, but we'll see how it goes. And we also have regular Wagyu steaks back in stock. so. Uh, we used to have 12 ounces. These are thicker cut, more like our standard ribeye steaks. So you guys can get one pound Wagyu ribeye steaks or one pound Wagyu strip steaks. They are $55 each. Again, not the most affordable thing, but compared to the rest of the Wagyu online, incredibly affordable. So those Wagyu cuts are the main thing that is new in stock this week. Uh, we might have some more stuff coming in. I know the organ grind is gonna be ready soon. And we're also going to try to do some more special stuff for you guys. Uh, but as always, if there's anything that you guys would like me to get, try to get you, whatever it may be, please send me an email, let me know, and I'll, uh, I will try my best. I lowered the price on a couple of things, guys. Uh, the lamb stomach, some specific organs. So take a look around, see, uh, I reorganized things on the website as well. Uh, we still do have some of the ground ribeye, ground strip, and ground pork in stock, which is also relatively new. We're going to do a new beef jerky marinade. Maybe in a week or two it should be ready, but uh, maybe not because we have a lot of plain beef jerky to sell. It's going to be uh, a healthier take on the traditional beef jerky that's made with like soy and sugar. We're going to use you know organic coconut aminos, honey, very, very high quality stuff. So I'm, I'm kind of excited for that, and I'm probably going to get even chubbier eating all of that new season jerky because it really does become hyper palatable uh, compared to the plain stuff which is still delicious. So in the fridge we have some organic lemons that's for the water kefir downstairs but the collagen broth is back in stock you guys have seen this you know you turn it upside down it doesn't come out it's very very gelatinous that's available on Frankie's free range foods. So is the chicken stock which is honestly way too cheap you know we're selling this high quality organic glass jar chicken stock for only five dollars but you know since we have nothing else to do with the chicken carcasses that's i figured that's what we would do all of the cheeses for the most part are in stock you guys saw we did the fondue recipe on saturday you could use gruyere and emmentaler you could do fontina for that if you'd like to and also some roast beef so you guys better start buying this roast beef because i'm losing my mind cooking this but rare red pinkish in the middle as i've said several times you know we don't put any preservatives or nitrates or anything in the meat to keep the pink color so when you open up this package you know it the texture so soft it rips apart it's basically raw in the middle uh, despite not being completely red i know everyone likes bacon so i was trying to think if i could do like sliced belly or something let me know guys uh, what was on the table was either curing it and doing like an unsmoked bacon that was sliced or if you could just take the whole rub belly, slice it up into better portions for you guys. Unfortunately, we don't have a smoker. And I don't plan on buying a smoker from China anytime soon. So we're down here at Organ Supplements Storage and nothing new this week. Uh, I think next week, if there's less going on, I'll, I'll do a whole rundown of the supplements and stuff for you guys. But the masticum that I mentioned earlier is just a little something I wanted to show you guys. It's from Kios. It's supposed to be sold in the original packaging. And there's a few companies that I've spoken about that are telling you to chew this. And if you chew it for a few minutes, a few times a week, maybe that's okay. But 
it's very hard on the jaw muscles and it causes facial imbalances. So if someone ever sells you mastic gum as like something to chew, like an actual physical chewing gum, uh, that's a red flag. Don't do it. I used to get such bad migraine headaches and I didn't know what it was from. It was actually from the, the tension in the jaw muscles. So uh, use it as an antimicrobial. The Greeks use it in a lot of cooking. Sometimes in like the supermarket, you'll see honey with mastic gum added from Greece. So keep in mind, not exactly for chewing. Wi-Fi shielding, Frankie's Naturals. I still have not gone to my tailor to get the uh, kind of like the baby sleeping bags for toddler protection. I definitely have to get those this week. Uh, we did run out of tooth powder, so I'm going to try to get the tooth powder orders out by the end of the week with those Best Bar orders. A couple things are supposed to come in. I think both of the whey protein and the lead powder, which you guys probably forgot about. Uh, we did a video on lead pain a couple months back. Has arrived in the New York port, but with customs clearance and everything and all that nonsense, I don't know when I'm actually going to have it. All of the new products that I've showed you guys, we have them at the top of the website on Frankie's Syringe Meat. And if you guys don't see it there, we have like the chicken stock and the collagen brought separately on frankiesyringefoods.com. It's just to ensure that the glass doesn't break with the ice and that you guys get your products intact. So thank you guys for joining me today. If you could please drop a like on the video, leave a comment down below, subscribe so that YouTube can unsubscribe you next week, and be sure to check that notification bell so they don't notify you of my videos. Thanks again, guys. All the businesses are on frank-tefano.com. I'll see you for tomorrow.